Come on, Jeff. We're doing pecan again this year. Oh, you are? Yeah. Come on, Jeff. I'll get down here by the shed and make him look better. <laughs> Come on, Jeff. Yeah, I'll get down here, Mr. Corner. Come on, Michael. Come on, Michael. Come on, Michael. Yeah, you go. Get our sign there. Lions in. Club International Foundation will want that sign in there for certain. That's right. Well, on behalf of the Lions Club of Alabama, District 34B, District Governor Robert Thompson and and others involved in this project, we were able to apply for a grant from Lions Club International Foundation and Chicago, Illinois for these decontamination devices. This is an E-Mist Epix 360. It's a, it has a four ounce reservoir on it that'll decontaminate, according to the instructions, 4,000 square feet per container. Uh, and they, they say it's 100% effective. So we have brought this E-Mist 360 over here to donate to the Chambers County Sheriff's Department for the good people in Chambers County. We know there's been a high incidences of death over here as a result of the COVID-19 virus, that's uh, the pandemic that's hit our state. We wanted to do our part to try to combat the virus as much as we can. So we were able to buy eight of these machines to distribute around central Alabama. Because of the, the high incidences of death in Chambers County, Chambers County certainly was high on our list. So we're proud to, to donate this piece of equipment to the Chambers County Sheriff's Office on behalf of the Lions Club of East Alabama, Auburn, Opelika, and and Valley, and who else is represented here? I think I that think gets you most it. of us. Yeah. Uh, and, and we just know that this will be a great value to the people over here. This is a remarkable piece of equipment. Uh, we know that it's going to help control and, and, and possibly eliminate the, the virus that's affected this area. So it's our pleasure again to be able to donate this piece of equipment to the good folks over here. And uh, we hope that you remember the Lions Club International Foundation who has made it possible through a grant that they've given us and uh, support your Lions Clubs in East Alabama. Sheriff? Thank you, sir, and, and we appreciate it. Thank you all. Yep. Fantastic. Yeah. Uh, thank you all. Uh, you guys do great. You guys do great work. Um, we appreciate everything you all do. Your glasses, vision, that's a, that's a big staple of what the Lions Club does and just get involved in the community. This is a big deal, and, and we thank you. You want to write down everybody's name while they're still in line? Let's do it. Let's uh, let's start uh, let's start on this end right here, sir. If you could. I'm James Morgan Jr. with the Opelika Alliance Club. Thank you, sir. You? Doug Hicks, Opelika Alliance Club. Greg Boyd, Opelika Alliance Club. Lucas Stokes, Opelika Alliance Club. Fantastic. Philip Sparks, Valley. Thank you. Bubba Bingham, Council Chair, District Multi District 34B for Alabama Lions. All right. Sid Lockhart, Sheriff of Chambers County. Jeff Jones, Chambers County Coroner. Michael Smith, Boys and Girls Ranch. Thank you. Thomas Sims, Chambers County Sheriff's Office. All right. We've got Mike Parrish over here. So. All right, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Big day. Uh, congratulations. Um, a big day here for the Sheriff's Department uh, with a presentation from the Lions Club, Falcon.